Hey everyone, it's 112 here. Welcome back to another live stream. That was the wrong uh, scene, but welcome back everyone. Uh, today we're going to be playing some more Chrono Trigger. Uh, I admit I am a little nervous about this stream because the last time we tried to beat Magus, we got our butts handed to us. So we're going to try again. I, we're getting close to level 25. Let me get up the guide that I was using real quick. And then we're going to start. All right, there's that. But I'm mostly looking for a different guide. Where is it? There we go. All right, yep, Magus's Castle. So we're going to make our way through Magus's Castle again, and we're going to try and beat him. I don't know how successful we're going to be, but we're, we're certainly going to try. All right, so let me, let me boot up Steam real quick, and we will start. I also hope the game doesn't crash. That would be really bad, because so far the game hasn't crashed too many times, but it's happened a couple times. Enough that I get a little nervous. So, all right. Let me just switch the scene real quick, and we're going to get going. There we go. You guys should be able to see the game at this point. All right. Let's, uh, let's, get, let's keep going. Hopefully the stream title and everything is good. There we go. All right, so we're right in Magus's castle. What's my inventory like? How many? How much stuff do I have? Twenty-one potions, seven mid ethers, twenty mid potions. I think I should be okay. I might get more mid ethers if we fail again. What are, what are my levels? Twenty-four for everyone. Twenty-three for uh, Marl and Luca. All right, so let's head back to Magus then. See how we can do. So we're gonna have to make our way up through these battles again, but that's no big deal. This is actually, this is actually good because, oh, I'm not even at full health. Crap, all right. Uh, let's just use lightning. This will be good for us to get a little bit of experience. So, nice. Okay, nice. Oh, nice, Chrono's level increase. So, he's at level 25. All right, let's try using lightning two again. See uh, how that does. Otherwise, I'm use the Masamune. All right, nice. All right, well that kills everyone. But I don't, I don't want to waste too much MP is the problem because I'm already a little low on MP. Nice. All right, would like to have the other two uh, have their level increased, but if not, that's whatever. But I know those guys are not. That's not gonna work. So let's see. Let's use Wind Slash. Actually, no, let's use Cleave on this guy. And I'm gonna use uh, Aerial Strike on you. That did a lot of damage. And let's use, I'm just gonna do a regular attack on this guy. Cause that should, yeah, that should kill him. Right, I might need to use, uh, I might need to be a little more stringent with my, uh, what's it, my, MP usage for Chrono, because I'm running a little low on MP, and I do not want to use my ethers. There we go. Got a mid ether. Okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll probably use that then. Alright, uh, let's see. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do? Uh, I don't want to use lightning. Uh, can I attack? Oh, I can attack these guys, so I'll do this. Uh, let's use, uh, hmm. I guess we'll use Aerial Strike again. Oh, come on, dude. Also, uh, Shivas, my apologies that I didn't, uh, respond to you earlier, but I'm doing okay. Today was a long day. Actually, on today, May 4th, or May the 4th, I guess, I had a college final, so that was a little stressful. But, uh, I'm glad that I'm done with that for the day, and I can relax. Also, I just realized Frog is very low on health, and I am going to want to deal with that ASAP. Alright. So yeah, let's let's deal with let, let's deal with that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use uh, Cure Beam on Frog. And I will use a regular attack on this guy. You know, I'll just use regular attacks for now, this should work. There we go. Nice. Mid ether. All right. Again, Chrono's at level 25, but I really need everyone to be at level 25. So this might take a little bit of grinding. 
But let's see if we can beat uh, all these guys. Right up here. Now we have this part. Sure, I'll fight some of these guys. Alright, um, use... What is this? Uh... Hmm. Well, I'll use heal, first of all, and then I'll just attack normally. Because I don't think I need to do anything other than, you know, regular attacks for this. There we go. That should work, yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, that did nothing! Okay, he's weak against magical attacks, so I am going to have to use some magical attacks. So I'll just use lightning on this guy. And then I'll attack these guys normally. Yeah, get out of here. Weak against physical attacks, okay. Alright, uh, so I'm going to attack you. There we go. Weak against magical attacks, okay. Ow! So let's do a physical attack. I'll just use water, I guess. And uh, I'll just use rocket punch on this guy. Because I think shadow, that should count as a shadow attack. Okay, that does not count as a shadow attack. Noted. Alright, so I guess I'll just attack him. I want to use water on you, though. And then this. That, and now he's, right now he's weak to like, magical attacks. There we go. Nice. Got a potion. That's nice. All right, let's continue upwards. Uh, I don't want to fight you, though. Not really a point to fighting one enemy. There's multiple enemies, sure. But one enemy, there's not really a point. Up here... Uh, one of these, there's a save point down there, actually, but I honestly don't think I want to go there yet. Instead, let's just continue, uh, yeah, let's just continue up. I should be okay. I'm a little low on health, but I should, I should be fine. So let's continue fighting these guys. Alright, uh, I am going to use lightning too, and then, and then I'm gonna have, uh, I'm gonna use a mid ether. Ow. And then I'll just attack. There we go. Oh, that did nothing, F. Thank you. That should do a bit of damage. Oh, combo counter, really? That's bad. Ow. Can we use a triple strike? Yeah, let's do a triple attack. Actually, no, that, that, that's a bit useless. I'll do, I'll do X strike on this guy, though. And then I'll just attack this guy. Playing a little low on health. Would like to level up, please. That'd be really nice. Uh, attack. Uh, heal. And attack. There we go. Nice, got some health back. And dead. Excellent. Alright, let's keep going. Hopefully this will be leveling up my party members a little bit. Oh, jeez. Okay. Actually, I probably wanted to fight that thing. Oh, well. I'll fight this guy, though. Alright, let's attack. Uh, let's do water. Ow. go and dead nice we're getting there we're getting there in hindsight i probably should have gone after that save point or i probably should have uh used that save point but whatever All right. nice and now we got more battles i think oh no wait that's probably the next room yeah, this room is where we got more battles. There we go. Alright, uh, let's use supersonic spin. There we go. That way I can take them both out. Alright, nice. 
More enemies. All right, let's attack you. I'll use water. And then, ow, come on, game. Right. I'm probably gonna have Robo use the uh, Cure Beam on Chrono, actually, because I'm a little worried about the health. All right, so now we weak to physical attacks, got you. Ow. So let's see. Let's use... Let's have Frog attack you with physical attacks. I'm gonna use Cure Beam on Chrono. And then I'm gonna just do this. Really? Come on. That's annoying. Alright, I'm gonna use Cure Beam again. And then I'll just attack. Attack. That should kill that guy. Yeah, there we go. All right, we to magical attacks. Gotcha. All right, so, lightning, and I'll just attack normally because this should kill him. There we go. All right, nice. All right, then we got a couple more battles to get through. All right, so now we got all these guys. All right, so let's start off with a. Uh, Hmm. Uh, let's start off with a supersonic spin. And I will use aerial strike on one of these guys, because I think some of them are going to die. Yeah, I figured as much. Alright, so let's use aerial strike on this guy. There we go. Ow. Alright, let's do a regular attack. Uh, I'll just do regular attacks this round. Okay. So now he's weak to magical attacks. Gotcha. Yep, still weak to magical attacks. Alright, so in that case... Oh, great, he's poisoned. Uh... Alright, so water... Um... Uh... I'll just attack him normally. This should be fine. There we go. Hopefully the poison goes away after the battle. That would suck otherwise. Oh, nice. Frogs and Robo's level increase. Perfect. So now we're at level 25 for everyone. All right. So we got one more set of enemies to deal with. All right. Uh, lightning. No, Lightning 2 is going to heal those two, but they're already at max health, so I don't really care. Uh, let's also use heal, just so I don't... Uh, just because I don't want to lose, I don't want to lose, obviously. I lose the physical attacks, so. Oh, whoops. Attacked the wrong enemy there, but it's not a huge deal. At least that guy will probably die, yeah. Right. So let's just do, all right, so let's do physical attacks, and that should work for now. Ow. That's annoying. At least you'll be dead. Goodbye. And let's see. Nice. I went to magical attack, so. So we can do here. Alright, so let's use lightning, water, and uh, I guess Robo Tackle. Okay, he's dead. Nice. Oh, Chrono's level increased once again. That's good to hear. Alright, now which one of these was this, was was the real one? I actually forget. Was it this one? Yeah, it was a, that that's the real one. So in that case, this is the save point. So what I want to do is I want to obviously I can save there, but instead I would like to use my uh, what's a barrier sphere? It reduces magical damage by one third. Oh, that'll be useful. And Ambrosia, I don't know what I think that restores everything if I had to guess. All right, well let's use a shelter. All right. Um. I think we should be good for the boss at this point. So let's save. Nope, I want to save. There we go. Oh, I will definitely hydrate because we're, we're about to try Magus. I'm trying to defeat Magus again. If we don't, we will grind on those guys down there until we get a higher level. But I don't, I, I think we should be able to beat him at level 25, at least from what I'm told. So let's try this again. Thankfully, we can skip the cutscene if we press the minus button, even though the 
Are you serious? No, get out of here. I want I don't want to fight right now. I really don't. Yeah, get out of here. Okay, well that was stupid. All right, so through here. Yeah, yeah, I know. I've already seen this. This cutscene is really cool, but I don't want to see it again. Here we go. I already know you're here, Magus. I already know. Wish I could skip this cut. Wish I could skip the rest of this, but I unfortunately cannot. So let's try this again. Hopefully we won't die. That would be nice. All right. I know this, apparently this is one of the harder battles in the game, so it's understandable that I won't, you know, that I didn't beat it on the first time, especially when I was a bit under leveled. But let's try again. Here we go. I'm a little bit worried, but let's try it. All right, so first we're gonna attack him. We'll just, we'll just attack him three times. Whatever. All right. Here we go. Absorbs all but light. All right. Well, I'm going to have to heal. All right. Okay. Now it's doing less damage. Nice. All right. All right. So what's his barrier right now? Absorbs all but fire. Well, unfortunately, I can't do anything about that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to heal, if I can heal, please. All right, so I'm going to use a mid potion on Chrono, and I'm going to use heal. And then I'm going to do a regular attack. There we go. Absorbs all but fire. Can you please switch your barrier? I'd really appreciate it. All right, so Frog, you are going to attack normally. Chrono, you are going to use a mid potion. And Robo, you're just going to attack. There we go. Absorbs all but water. Okay, now I can actually attack with freaking Frog. Please don't kill Frog. Please don't kill Frog. I'm almost dead, so that's not good. The frog might be dead now. All right, so in that case, uh, here beam, water, mid potion. Absorbs all but light. Oh, well, now it would have been nice. That would have been nice to know so I could attack him, but uh, what are you going to do? All right. Nice. All right, so in that case, uh, lightning. Heal beam and heal. All right, so now I'm going to heal a little bit for all of us. There we go. I probably didn't need to heal twice, but I just want to make sure I'm not dying. All right, there we go. This is going to be a tough boss. Let's see if we can do it. All right, I for, I think he's still weak to okay. He's weak to I think he's still weak to mm, I think he's still weak to fire. So just to be sure, I'm gonna use a, a regular attack. I'm gonna use uh, I'm gonna attack him. And what is he weak to now? Absorbs all but water. Great. I should have I should I should have waited. All right. Well, that was not good. At least his magic defense is going down now. Absorbs all but shadow. Alright. I'm gonna need to use uh, the heal attack. Because now Robo's... Alright, so let's see. Let's use heal. Let's attack. And let's use a shadow move, which is Robo Tackle. Seriously, dude? Well, now he's gonna absorb that. Ugh. That's so stupid. All right, well, at least it didn't... All, right, all but fire, I can't do anything about that. Robo's probably going to die from this, actually. Crap. Yeah, okay, well, Robo's not dead, but he's almost dead, so... Are you serious? Dang it, okay. Well, in that case, Athenian water. 
Uh, uh, he's weak. He's weak to fire right now, so attack. This is not going well. I need to be a little more patient. At least he's attacking Chrono and not anyone else. All right, so heal. Pure beam. All right, what is he weak to now? Light, okay, so Chrono is gonna be my best bet, but unfortunately I'm probably gonna die. All right, I think I know what I'm doing wrong. I think I'm just not being patient. All right, so let's see. Lightning. Heal. Heal beam. There we go. Absorbs all but shadow. Okay. Please don't die. Please don't die. Alright, so I'm going to heal everyone now. There we go. Probably need to use a mid potion, if anything. There we go. Alright, so he's, he's, he's weak to shadow right now, so I'm just gonna attack. Let's see what he's weak to now. Absorbs all but light. Okay, that was a mistake. I'm gonna have to use a mid potion on someone. Alright, so let's use a mid potion. Actually, no, let's use a regular potion on Chrono. He's weak to light right now, so I'm gonna have him attack, and then what is he gonna be weak to now? Okay, I think he's still weak to light, so let's use lightning. Uh, let's use heal. Let's use cure beam. Actually, wait, let's wait. Actually, no, I, good thing I didn't attack yet, because I want to use robo tackle for this. There we go. Alright, attack him. What? Okay, well now he's uh, absorbs all but water. Alright, so I'm gonna need to use heal beam. Ow. Alright, so let's use uh actually can I use a dual tech? Um Alright, so water Heal Beam. What is he weak to now? Actually, I'm going to use a uh, mid potion on myself. Here we go. Okay, he's lowering his guard. So basically what this means is he's about to do a really powerful attack. But until then, I can just hit him with the, uh, the triple strike. So we're going to do another triple strike because I'm, I'm pretty much fully healed. So there's another one. Yeah, dark magic. So now what we do is we heal. Like, we literally heal everyone. Because this is going to do a ton of damage. Yeah. So, heal. If we actually beat this, I swear to God. Because we're actually really close to... Actually, we don't really need that. I'll use a potion, though, on... Uh... There we go. Wait, so we're all good, and then triple attack. We're really close to killing him, guys. We're really close. Alright, see, so yeah, he's beginning to... He's lowering his guard to cast a spell, so... Triple attack. He's almost dead. He's almost dead. Come on. Triple attack. He's gotta be almost dead. Come on. Yes, we beat him! Let's go! Yo, first try! That was awesome! Hell yes! Get out of here, Magus. You are dead. I am definitely hydrating. Your skill with the Masamune is that great already? Oh, man. I cannot believe I did that first try. I was expecting that to take... Almost the whole stream. So, that is awesome. Hell yes, our skill with the Masamune is great. Large-scale energy reaction detected. Could it be Lavos?
Oh, I sure as hell hope not. No, he mustn't awaken from his slumber yet. Awaken? I do not understand. According to the records, Lavos was created here at this precise moment. You fools! I but summoned him! He has dwelt within the earth for eons, absorbing the land's energy and growing ever stronger. It appears my data was incorrect. What is this energy in the air? I am detecting the emergence of a gate of theoretically improbable proportions. You, if you had not interfered, an enormous gravity sink is forming. Whoa! Uh-oh, that doesn't sound good. Whoa! That is some crazy mode 7! Uh-oh, that doesn't look good. Uh, guys, I think we might have screwed up. <laughs> Uh, oops. Uh-oh. What are those bells? Chrono. Chrono! Chrono, are you still there? Honey, are you okay? Or at least that's what I thought. I didn't mean to skip past it. Dear me, I'd forgotten how beautiful Lean's bell sounds. Chrono, we can't keep asking my father for help. You need to hold down a job. Chrono, 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 Chrono. I think I said that enough times. Eight times eight. Times eight, really. The hell? We're back in the prehistoric era now? Chrono awake? Madam Ayla, which would mean we are currently... Ayla want to see Chrono. Go Mystic Mountain. You there. Fall down hurt. Ayla carry back hut. Well, thank you, Ayla. I appreciate that. Magus. Big frog present? For Ayla eat? No, do not eat frog. P perish the thought. But what of the pale-faced man in the cape? Was he not with us? No, only find you. Cape one more tasty? No, don't eat Magus either. That's cannibalism. So he has fled. The records were incorrect, but if Magus, if Magus did not create Lavos, then in what era did it originate? Lavos? You no worry now. You rest. Hurt bad. That's, we, we did die like three times before getting that, so... Well, at least we're okay now. Chrono okay now? Ayla busy. Try find Laruba village. Find village, fight reptiles together. Big fight, last fight, beat all reptiles or reptiles beat us all. Kino. What wrong? Chrono rest, you be quiet. Northwood fire, big burn, big, er, burn, big burn. All right, well, let's check out what, let's see what that's about. And let's definitely save our game, first of all. Forward to the past. All right, well, I presume we want to go north but I'm going to check the guy just to make sure. I'm still in shock that we did that on our first try. That was ridiculous. Hold on a second. All right. Uh, well, apparently the first thing we should do is go to the trading hut because apparently we can get some new stuff if we... Uh... Oh, you come see me? What you have. All right, so let's see if we can get some stuff. Uh, I want to get the... I definitely want to get the, the uh, Eon Blade. So that's Fang and Horn. So Fang and Horn. Primeval Blade. Uh, I mean, I guess we can get that, but no. Yes. Okay, I guess we'll get the Primeval Blade. So that's Fang and Horn and Primeval Blade. Yes. Nice. Uh, I'm good. So let's see what exactly. Let's see what our. Let's see what the primeval blade does. I I hope it's more powerful. Oh yeah, that's definitely more powerful. Let's equip that. Um, let's also see if we can get the magma hand. So yeah, I want to trade again. I didn't mean to do that. Hold on. All right. So we. So for the magma hand, we need a petal and a feather. Oh, we don't have enough feathers. Uh, we can probably get the dream gun, though. Petal and fang. Oh, we don't have enough fangs. All right, so in that case, we can only get petal and horn, which is, uh, the dream bow. So let's get that. So petal. I, I, 
Dang it. Hold on. I swear I'm not bad at video games. All right, pedal and horn. So, Dreamstone Bow. Yes, thank you. So, let's equip that tomorrow. I don't want to trade anymore. All right. So, equipment. Let's equip that tomorrow. There we go. Nice. All right. So, now we need to head north, I believe. Um, let's see. Oh, well, apparently it's actually best if we go, um, apparently we can actually go back to some other time periods and do some side quests. So let's actually do that. I could definitely use a little bit of respite. <laughs> so, all right. So we're going to want to go to, uh, back to our time period, which is 1000 AD. All right, we'll have to fight these guys, but I can just auto battle them at this point. Yeah, it's just auto battle. This will be nothing compared to uh, what we had to do earlier against frickin' Magus. Alright. So back to the end of time we go. I'm actually going to switch up my party a little bit as well. I want to use some other characters, especially Marl. Alright. Get out of here. Nice. So let's finish this battle, and then I'll switch party members. Nice. And there we go. We got a horn and a pedal, so that's nice. Uh, Alright, so party. I want to use Marl instead of Frog. And I'll keep Robo around for now. Oh, guess we're fighting these guys, too. I'll just auto battle for now. We don't really need to do anything. This is these guys aren't gonna kill me. I just want to go back to my own time period, please. <laughs> All right, come on, let us attack, please. Thank you. <sighs> Hope you guys are doing okay. By the way, I know uh, Shivis is here. Shout out. By the way, shout out to to just being a great mod. Seriously, you're. You really help out around the streams. I really appreciate it, Shivitz. It means a lot to me. Right. So we can do. Beat these dragon guys, or I guess they're really dinosaurs, not dragons, but you know what I mean. There we go. Nice. And let's continue on. Uh, all right, so let's head back to the end of time. Yep, jump down. Yeah, we want to head back to our own time. All right, so, all right, let's, let's heal up. Oh, that means a lot to me, Shivis. Thank you. All right, is this 1000 AD? No. Uh, Medina Village, no. I want to go to the... Actually, that probably is where I want to go. Nope, not there. Nope. Is this the right one? Lean Square, there we go. I want to head back to uh, our own time for the moment. It's been a while since we've been to Lean Square, actually. But uh, what we want to do is uh, we want to head back to the castle. Because we can get some new stuff, which is nice. So let's keep going down here. Right. Nope, not to the market. Oh, I will definitely hydrate. All right. Guardia Forest, just so we can get to the castle. Nice. All right, let's head up to the castle. Hey. Remember, last time we were here, we were like accused of kidnapping Marl. So let's see what happens now. Like I said, I think this is more of a side quest type thing, but I'll I'll take what I can get. There we go. And there we go. We got a potion, so that's nice. All right, up here. We gotta fight another enemy, but thankfully these guys are really easy, so it's no big deal. We're like at least 20 levels over where we should be to fight these guys. We can probably kill them all in one blow at this point, yeah. 
go. Nice. And there we go. All right, so up here. And I don't feel like fighting any more of those. They don't give much XP anyway. Into the castle. Princess Nadia. You had me worried, princess. I understand your feelings, of course. The king places his realm above all else. It was even the same when your mother queen, Eliza, passed away. What? Oh, child, please, forget I spoke. Tell me. It's difficult to speak of even now. You see, Queen Eliza's condition had been frail for some time, but it took a sudden turn for worse near the end. She desperately wanted to see your father, just one last time. But your father refused, said he could not leave his work unattended. He left you, young, innocent, and knowing nothing of death, to watch over her alone. Naturally, the end was not long in the coming. She died soon after. Ooh, my condolences. One might well say the king killed her. Such a shame. Ugh. Father killed her? Please, I speak too much. Do not let it trouble you, your highness. Now that you've finally returned, why don't why won't you go see the and see the king? You're aw acting awfully nice, considering you tried to kill us last time. All right, hang on. Um, one second. All right, so apparently, if we go to the right here. Go right from the entrance and go up one for a hyper ether, which would be really useful. Nice! A turbo. I guess it's called a turbo ether here. Alright, so now we need to head over to the king's bedroom, which I. That's not the way to the king's bedroom. I want to say it's over here? Question mark? I actually forgot where it is. But let's see if we can find it real quick. Alright. Oh! Nadia! What have you come here for? I thought you had no more use for this place. Hmm. Don't you look at me like that. You're the one who stormed out of here and letting those hoodlums in here. Are you planning to cause some sort of trouble? Well, not really. How can you say things like that? These are my friends. Friends? You're a daughter in the, of the line of Guardia. Consorting with their like is a disgrace to this family's name. Well, screw you too. It's true then. You d really do care more about the kingdom than you ever cared about me or mother. Ouch. What? You, you killed my mother. <sighs> Get out. Do not show your face here again. Don't worry, I won't. I love that sprite of her shouting. That's hilarious. Do as you please. You are not my daughter. Whew, that was interesting. Oh dear. All right, um, hold on. All right, so yeah, let's head up to her uh, father's room. Apparently there's some stuff we can get now, which is nice. Anything over here? No. Well, there's something in here. We got an elixir, that's nice. Can't open that thing though. Any other chests? No? Okay. Oh, wait. There's a chest right over there. Nice. A high ether. That is definitely going to come in handy. Hmm. What have you come here for? You have no business in this place. All right. And apparently if we go to Marl's room, we'll get a mega elixir. But I don't remember where that is, so... All right, uh, let's, let, I'll, I think I, I, actually, I think I have somewhat of an idea of where it is, but if it's not there, I'm just gonna, we're gonna go to the next thing. I think it's pro, I, my guess is it's over here. All right, uh, not in there. Oh, there it is. Yep, we got a turbo ether. Anything in here? No. All right, let's head over to Marl's room. Oh, what are you all staring at? And we get a mega elixir, nice. It's, I'm the personal tutor in charge of Her Highness's education. Hello, I'm in charge of the princess's physical fitness. I'm in charge of discipline. The latest incident is all my fault. I should have been more strict. More strict? That would have made things worse. What is wrong with you people? All right, well, let's get out of here. That's all I wanted to come here for. A couple of items and I guess a bonus scene. All right, so now we need to head back to uh, the end of time. So let's do that real quick. 
I feel so bad for Marl, though. Like, jeez, that is that has really got to sting. Like, your own father hates you like that? I, I can't even imagine. That's, uh, that's pretty horrible. All right. I don't feel like fighting these enemies again, so let's just get out of here. There we go. All right. Down here. And back to Lean Square. Also, by the way, I, I think, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but May the 4th be with you. Because uh, today is actually May 4th, or the day I'm recording this on. So, yeah, May the 4th be with you all. I, I guess if you're watching the VOD version, that doesn't really work. But, you know what I mean. I do love Star Wars. Hopefully we can play a Star Wars game on uh, on stream at some point. Can I heal, please? Thank you. And, yeah, let's save. Yep, save our game. Nice. Right. And is, I think there was something else I wanted to do, actually. Let me check. Alright. Um... Alright. Uh, apparently, if we go to 600 AD, we'll get another... We'll get, some, we'll get some extra dialogue with, like, everyone thanking Frog, but we don't need to do that. Let's just head on. Alright, so let's head back to, uh, six, uh, yeah, Mystic Mountains. So let's uh, let's continue the plot now. Just wanted to get that to get a couple items out of the way. We'll have to fight at least one of these enemies though, because th that guy is really annoying to dodge. Some of these enemies are really annoying to dodge, and I don't feel like fighting these guys right now. But all right, I guess we'll fight these guys. All right, auto battle time. <laughs> I love this battle theme. It's definitely really, really good. Not my favorite battle theme in any RPG, but it's definitely up there. Alright. There we go. 22 damage. Alright, not that bad. Yeah, whack him upside the head with the bow. Alright, here we go. Yeah, we, we can just do normal attacks for now. No big deal. Right. Just keep going. Yeah, we, we just got to auto battle this. Not really much else to do. I guess now's a good time for questions since we're not really doing anything else. We're not grinding exactly, but we need to get through these enemies. If you guys have any questions, definitely feel free to ask. In the chat, I mean. Live chat. Right. Ow. Get out of here. Nice. Got some experience. Got a horn in the pedal. Not bad. Not bad at all. I don't feel like fighting you two. I do not want to fight you four either. All right. So let's continue on. We have to go north, I believe, is what uh, Mela said or whatever her name was. Sorry, I forgot. To the woods. So probably up here if I had to guess. So, Laruba Ruins, I believe, is where we're supposed to go next, if I remember correctly. Hold on. Can my phone unlock? Yes, Laruba Ruins. All right. Reptiles take Kino. Reptiles kill all. Try stop reptiles. What do now? Uh-oh. Ayla, this is your fault. Look at Village. I wouldn't exactly say this is Ayla's fault. Reptiles follow you. Now village ruined. Hmm. Ayla, sorry. Reptiles strong. Live long before us. So we hide. But Ayla say fight together. Ayla say fight now. Ayla alive. Ayla fight. Win, live, lose, die. That rule. No can change rule. Well, technically she's correct. Old man breathe, but dead inside. Ouch! That is a... Ooh, that's a harsh burn. Ayla's strong, so make big talk. We not strong. No, strong, fight, get more strong. You know what? I'm actually going to screenshot that because that is literally RPGs in a nutshell. No, strong, fight, get more strong. <laughs> that's basically all the RPGs ever. Ayla, help, but now need dactyl. Give dactyl. 
Dactyl? Go Tyranno Lair? Tyranno Lair Reptile Castle. Danger. Even Ayla danger. Ayla want die? No. Wants live, so go. Ayla be okay. Give Dactyl. Yes, give Dactyl. Elder Tail Keeper. So da so go Dactyl Nest. Ayla be careful. Elder, big help. Alright, nice. Um, hold on. One second. Alright, so we're supposed to continue up, but I'm actually going to save real quick, just because I didn't really save earlier, so let's just save. And let's keep going. Should be good on uh, stuff for now. So, any anything over here? Nope. All right. Well, let's go up then. Right. Why am I not going up? Is that not where I'm supposed to go? Hold on. Uh, where am I supposed to go? Question mark. I am very confused. If those are RPGs in a nutshell, then would platformers be jump and then jump more? I guess. Uh, oh, Dactyl Nest. All right. All right, so yeah, now we gotta go through the Dactyl Nest. Uh, guess we're fighting this guy. All right. Uh, I'll just attack normally. Nope, I want to use... Although for you, I want to use Ice. And I'll use uh, Wind Slash. Oh, yep, good good time to posture check. Good point. Ow! What the hell was that? That's that's rude. Okay, that's actually dealing a lot of damage. Crap. All right. Uh, here. Uh, Robo Tackle and Lightning. Nice. Well, I kind of wasted that, but okay. Oh, the rocks are hurting me too? Well, that's just great. All right. Uh, let's use Cleave, and then I'm going to use uh, Cure Beam on Chrono. And there's still another rock. All right. Can I use Triple Strike? No, I can't. But I can use Ice Sword. Get out of here. Zero? Well, I guess... Well, wait, no. I feel like ice should work work on rocks. That's stupid. Come on. All right. Uh, Cyclone sweep? Let's try that. Okay. Noted. Physical attacks are what you want to do against the rocks. Got a fang. Marl's level increased. Uh, I'm actually going to switch out a party member. Uh, I don't think we need two healers. So let's switch out uh, let's switch out Luca for Robo for now. There's a chest up there. Oh, we got some more enemies. Alright, uh, let's use what is Antipode Bomb? Oh right, this is the fire and ice attack. Alright, well it killed them, so I'll I'll take it, I guess. Nice. Alright, so up here. What's in this chest? A mid ether. Not bad. I will definitely take that. There's a chest over there, too. Although, first, I'm gonna have to fight these rock guys. So, physical attacks it is. Alright, uh, cleave. Uh, let's see. Alright, well, unfortunately, Marl's kind of stuck. Actually, so is Luca. Wind slap. And, yeah, I, I can't really do anything with Marl, or with uh, Luca, because she uses, uh, she uses fire. I don't know if that's going to deal damage. Yeah, I figured as much. All right, so, uh, in that case, Cleave, I'm going to have to use regular attacks. I, this is, like, the worst time to switch out Luca, to switch out for Luca and Marl, because they literally don't do physical attacks. I am big dumb. All right, let's use Cleave, and I'll just attack. But at least they'll get some experience. There we go. Nice. All right. Let's keep going. Got a mid potion. Not bad. I'll take it. All right. Uh, I think we're supposed to go up here. Yeah. Anything over there? Nope. All right. Up 
here. More of these. All right, these guys actually will probably be a little bit better for Marl and Luca. So, all right. So let's start out with uh, Antipode Bombs. That seems to do a lot of damage. And then I'm going to use Cleave on the Rock. Oh, that actually killed the Rock. Okay. Ow. All right, time to use uh, Aura on uh, Marl. So I'm doing a little, I'm a little low on health. Yeah, I really should. All right, so let's use um, Aura. And uh, sure, we can use Fire Sword, I guess. That works. Nice. 675, excellent. Got a Petal and got a Fang. Oh, nice, Luca learned Napalm. We'll try using that in the next uh, battle. Up here, got to climb to the top. All right, we're making our way to the top. Got more of these rock guys, unfortunately. Let's see if I can get the chest first. Mesozaic male. I assume that's a. That's a. No, I don't want to use that. I assume I can equip that to someone. Oh, nice. That's good for Chrono. I'll take it. All right. Uh, in that case, let's just fight these rock guys real quick. Oh, and that guy too, I guess. Hello. All right, what are these guys called? Uh, actually, I want to use... Hold on. I want to use... Uh, let's just try using Napalm. Alright, what, what are these uh, rock guys called? They're called Schists. I feel like that's a joke or a pun, but I don't get it. Probably a rock joke. Or like a joke about geology or something. Well, ice seems to do a lot... Or the ice sword seems to do a lot of damage. Alright, uh, Napalm... That does nothing. <laughs> that is that is not a good move for that. All right, all right. Uh, let's use aura. Yeah, let's use aura world because I'm getting a little low on health for Chrono, and everyone could use some health right now. There we go. Uh, let's use. Uh, oh geez. Let's use antipode bomb, and then I'll just attack a rock. There we go. Nice. That way I can kill that guy. Or, that didn't do that much damage that time. Whoops. Well, at least the rock is probably dead. The schist. Okay, the schist is not dead. Really? Uh, Ice Sword did a lot, I guess? Let's try that. Because I remember Ice Sword did a lot, so... No, what do you mean, zero? Uh... Alright, uh, this is not going well. I guess I'll use Napalm again or something. I don't know. Please die. Ah, oh, that's doing nothing against that guy. Dang it. This really is not a good party for this. Can you please die? Thank you. All right, let's just do regular attacks against him for now, because that seems to be doing more damage. Also, uh, I got a pedal and a fang, and Chrono's level increased, and Luca's level increased, so that's nice. I'm gonna need to. I'm gonna need to get use a mid ether in a moment. I'm a little low. Okay, these guys are weak to antipode bombs, so that'll be useful. All right, so let's use antipode bomb. And if I get the chance, I will use a uh, an ether on myself. Although I might actually, yeah, I was about to say the enemies might die first. Oh well. Oh well. What are you gonna do? Got a feather. Oh, I got rays. That's nice. I don't know what that does, but we'll find out, I guess. Oh, cutscene time. Hey, it's Ayla. Uh-oh. That doesn't look good. Uh, Ayla? Ayla, you might want to get away from... Oh, actually, wait, hold on. Before we do anything, let's actually use... Let's use, an... let's use our mid ether that I was going to use earlier. I'll use... Yeah, I'll use three. All right, Chrono. You aren't trying to sneak off without us, are you? No, Tyranno lay layer danger. Yet you know, come maybe all die. We defeated Magus. We will be fine. Nope, we can't turn our backs on you like that. We owe you one, right, Chrono? Yes. <laughs> Ayla have good friend. 
All right, it's set to the Tyranno Lair. Oh, I guess we can just fly there now. All right, I guess. I was thinking there'd be a boss fight. Oh, okay, so we need to choose a third party member. Uh, I'm gonna check if there's like a specific part that we need something for, but I don't know. Um, let's see. Uh, let, let's go with, let's go with, uh, hmm. Who do I want to go with? Actually, yeah, let's go with Marl for now. She could, yeah. Yeah, we'll go with Marl for now. We can always switch if, if necessary, but I think we should be good with Marl. All right. Ooh, another cutscene. Or another uh, animated cutscene. What are these guys? I don't know their names, but these guys look cool. I love these animated cutscenes. These look awesome. I wonder if they're like animated by Akira Toriyama at all. That would be that would be really bad. I, I they might be. I don't know. All right. Well, we're off to the reptile castle. So, let's see what we can do. Oh, we can fly. That is cool. All right. So where do we have to go exactly? Uh, hold on. I love that we can fly now. Uh, where's Tyranno Lair? Uh, don't exactly know where it is. Crap. We gotta find it. Can I, uh, where? Oh, it's probably over here. Hmm, I wonder where it is. The big flying castle, maybe? How do I land, though? Okay, there we go. Oh, they are animated by Akira Toriyama. That's awesome. Um, how do I fly again? Well, regardless, I guess we're going into Tyranno Lair. Oh, we should probably... Uh, actually, no. We, we, should, we should be fine. I will use a... Uh, I, I should probably heal in the next battle, but we should be fine. All right. I guess we're fighting these guys. All right. Uh, let's use Drill Kick. I haven't used that one yet. And I'm going to use uh, Cure on Chrono. There we go. Nice. All right, let's see what we can do. Uh, Woundillo kick. I'm just getting used to using uh, Ayla again. We haven't used her in a while. Uh, Raise. Oh, Raise. Oh, that's awesome. Revise a KO ally. All right, that's going to be really useful. I'll just ice if this doesn't kill them. All right. Ow. All right. Uh, let's see. Drill kick. Let's see what we can do. Nice. Got some experience. Got some tech points. Got a fang. Got a mid potion. All right. Is there somewhere else we're supposed to? Are we supposed to go in here, I guess? Yeah, I guess so. Right, up down here. Fight these guys. Oh, now we got the regular battle theme. Uh, Lundillo kick. Lightning two. And ice. There we go. If 
Defense lowered by electric shock. Awesome. There we go. Nicely done. Got some experience for that. We got a mid potion. Can I flee these guys? Oh, nice. Yay, we freed the villagers. All right, well, that's nice. Um, hold on. Um, all right, well, apparently there's something in the cell. Oh, or not. Don't want to lock ourselves in the cell, that's for sure. All right, let's keep fighting these guys. All right, uh, I'll just attack normally, and then we will use, uh, sure, Ice Sword. Ow. These guys don't seem too hard, though. Oh, that's overkill. All right, let's just use normal attacks for now. Yeah, well, let's just use normal attacks for now. <laughs> All right, nice. Got a mid potion. Got haste. I know that's one of the, apparently haste is one of the best spells in the game, so that's nice. We're about to have a feast, and you're about to be the roast beast. Hehehe. <laughs> nice pun. Or I guess rhyming. It's not really a pun. It's more rhyming. It's the apes. Who are you calling apes? I'll have you know we have a robot in our party. All right, Wendillo kick. Ice sword. Yeah, that's definitely overkill. So let's let's rely on normal attacks for now. They're not even doing that much damage anyway. There we go. And get out of here. Nice. Got some experience. Got another mid potion. Ayla's level increased. Let's free him. C come on. Press the button. There we go. Ayla! Kino, move back. Ayla, save Kino. There's a button right there. Come on. Or I guess you could do that. Sure. Well, now you're trapped in there, too. Wow. Kino, sorry. All Kino's fault. It okay. Kino, take all Laruba person. Run. What Ayla do? Strong live, weak die. Ayla, go be strong. Kino, go too. Kino, no come. Ayla, die. Kino, new Ioka chief. Ayla. Okay, I guess we didn't need the button. Ayla, strong. No lose. Kino, no. Kino, show you something. Follow Kino. Oh, okay. I guess I could follow you for a little bit. All right. Where are you taking us? Up here. Through here. Oh, thank you. You strong. Kino weak. Kino jealous. Appreciate it. All right. I want to. I do want to figure out how to fly though. Like, how do we uh, equip our? Can we fly again? Nope. I don't know what button will be flying, because that's we're gonna have to figure that out if we want to escape from here. Oh, it's A. Okay, well, noted. Yeah, okay, we can just press A then. I just wanted to make sure because I don't want to like trap myself or something. Alright, well let's continue on. Of course the enemies respawn, but I'm not gonna fight him again, no point. Alright, let's see what's over here. Uh ooh, those guys look tough. Anything over here? Oh, okay. Guess we're fighting some enemies. What the hell? What, are these guys going to fall too? Uh, no, these guys will not fall. Okay. All right. Uh, let's use Kiss on Chrono so that way I can get a little bit of health back. Uh, we'll try using Haste. And I'll attack. There we go. Nice. Ow. That guy seems to do a lot of damage. Yeah, he does a lot of damage. Ah, uh, crap. I need to heal. All right, uh, kiss on Chrono. I'll use lightning again. 
And I am going to heal because that actually did a lot of damage. Uh, I'll also use haste on myself, I guess. Shocked. Nice. Nice. There you go. Now I have haste too. Lightning. Actually, I'll use lightning too this time just to attack everyone. Mandillo kick. Although I have like no MP now, so that's a slight problem. Get out of here. Nice. Alright, I can just attack this guy into oblivion now. Goodbye. Excellent. Got a mid potion too. Alright, let's see what's down here then. More of these guys. I just want to make sure I'm going the right way. Hang on. Oh, apparently, um... Hold on. Yeah, we need to head down the right path. Oh, posture check. That's a good point. Oh, I could have just pressed that switch. I'm an idiot. Alright. Let me posture check real quick. Yep. Oh, come on! Well, I guess we're fighting these guys now. Hello. Ow. Uh, well, I can't use lightning too. Uh, time to use a mit. Time to use an ether, or a couple ethers. All right. Let's, use, uh, let's go with. Um, uh, run. Actually, let's use drill kick on this guy. Uh, I'll use ice. On this guy as well. Actually, that should kill him. Okay, I guess we're using ice on this guy. Nice. Go, and dead. Oh, nope, he's not dead yet, but he should be dead soon, so no big deal. Probably should use some more ethers once the battle's over, though. Got a fang, got a mid potion. Alright, uh, good to know. I should not do that in the future. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. Right up here. Step on the switches, because that'll lower those guys. And let's try opening the other dragon egg. Nice, we got a high potion. Well, that's useful. Oh, well, got to fight these guys now, though. Although, this, this shouldn't be too... Okay, now that guy's there. Alright, uh... Mandillo, uh, I guess we'll use a, I guess I'll use Kiss on Marl, since he's a little low on health. And I'll use Lightning, too. There we go. Get out of here. Well, that didn't kill those guys, but at least I lowered their defense a little bit. Oh, I forgot to use that, uh, the ethers. Whoops, all right, well, no big deal. I'll just use him right now. Got a feather. Got a mid potion. Marl's level increased. All right. Uh, yeah. Inventory. I want to use a couple ethers. That's good. Nice. Right. Uh, can't go over there. I do not want to fight you guys again, so I'll just drop you down. I am going to have to fight you guys, though, so. Although, I should be able to beat these guys by just auto-battling, because they don't have that much health. Yeah, they don't have much health, so I can just beat them like this. I like Marl's new gun, or I guess bow gun, really. That's nice. Alright, there we go. And this should kill him. Nice. Let's see what we can do. Got a mid potion. Definitely will take that. Gotta fight these guys. Or, I was gonna say these guys, but I guess it's just the one enemy. Uh, yeah, I can auto-battle this. Whatever. Donut doesn't have that much health anyway. I'm doing 200 damage every blow, so... Got a feather. Alright, what's over... Oh, this is gonna suck. Alright, uh, drill kick. So many false floors. Makes me wonder how people who live in this castle even got through it. I know, right? That's a great point. I, I guess you have to memorize all where all the false floors are if you live here, which... Sounds pretty terrible, I'm not going to lie. 
Oh, it's I just realized the dragon guy is there. That might be a problem. Alright, uh no actually I want to I want to use Kiss on Chrono. And I will use Cleave. There we go. That did nothing. The house becomes an in real life Metroidvania. Wow. Alright, uh, uh oh. That's bad. That's bad. Uh, Cure. Chrono is almost dead. Crap. Definitely need to use Cure. There we go. And let's just attack this guy. Oh, that's doing nothing. Uh oh. I might have made a mistake. I might have made a mistake. Crap. Crap, this is bad. Uh-oh. Ow, stop the- What the hell? What the hell was that? That did so much damage. Alright, Lightning 2, first of all, and you are going to use uh, Rendillo Kick. Actually, I should have just used Lightning 1, honestly. Defense Lord by Electric Shock. Get out of here! Oh my god. Alright, uh, Drill Kick, and I'll just attack. 873, nice. Get out of here. Jeez, that was that. I hate that reptile guy. Oh, Ayla learned Cat Attack, and we got the Thunderclomp Dual Tech. Um. What the hell? What is going on here? What? It's like the. Things warp us. That is weird. They like warped us around or whatever. Can we go any further up? No. All right, nothing over here. Well, never mind. More of these guys. Uh, let's see. Let's try using cat attack. Uh, I will use rays. Actually, no, I don't really need to use Raze. I'll just use, uh, Cleave. And I'll attack like normal. Yeah, this'll, this'll be enough. There we go. Whew. Got a mid potion. That's useful. Can't go in there. Oh, not the dragon again. Ugh. Alright, um, cat attack. We need to kill that dragon first. Although I will use lightning too. Ow. Uh haste. On Chrono. Yeah. Have time for, for my turn, because I'm gonna want to use it attacks quite a bit. Alright, uh cat attack. Lightning. Oh, okay, dead. Nice. Chrono's level increased. Alright, through here. Uh, what's this? I cannot progress any further. Interesting. Did I go the wrong- Oh, I have to press the right button. I didn't mean to press both buttons. God damn it. Well, that didn't go as planned. Uh, yeah, I need to heal Chrono, like, now. Uh, Lightning 2. Uh... Ice, I guess. Wait, that healed the guy? Oh, come on! That healed the stupid enemy. That's annoying. Get out of here. Alright, uh... Cat attack. And this should kill him. Oh, or not. Alright, this will probably kill him. There we go. I didn't mean to press both buttons. Dang it. What does this do? Oh, that probably opens the other door. Now that I think about it, yeah. There we go. Come on! Ah, uh, fine. Alright, uh... Cat attack. Um... Cleave. Ice. Yeah, Cleave should do a lot to this guy. Yeah, there we go. go. That did a decent amount. Ow. 115? That's so much. Come on. 
Ah, all right, we're using Aura Whirl. Stop doing that! And Cat Attack. Running a little low on MP, which isn't good. 96, what the hell? Ugh. Alright, uh, oh, alright, Rundillo Tech, or Rundillo Kick, and Lightning, can you please die? Defense lowered by Electric Shock, Ice, oh, Marl's at one health, so in that case, let us use a mid potion on Marl, or not, so well, I'm definitely going to use a mid potion now. Got a feather. All right, yeah, let's use a mid potion on Marl because she is literally at one health. Um, let's see. Oh, I can use Cure, I guess. There we go. I can just do that. <laughs> oh, seriously? How are there so many enemies here? Um, let's, see. let's do Thunder Clomp. I haven't done this attack yet. Oh, that is cool. That is really cool. 394, wow. All right, well, Ayla's almost out of MP. Actually, we're all almost out of MP, so that's not great. Uh, all right, let's wait for that. No, I want to use Ice Sword. Oh, wait, crap. I forgot that Ice doesn't do anything to these guys. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Oh, or not. I guess, I guess that did a lot. Ha! Eight damage. Right, I'm just gonna use normal attacks on this guy. Oh my god! Ha ha! You hurt yourself. Mid potion and Ayla's level increase. Excellent. Well, there's the save point, but I'm also. Uh... All right. Um, I don't know if we can take him. All right. Uh, I am going to uh, uh, use some. Mm. Let's see. Probably should have stocked up on a couple of uh, potions now that I think about it. Do we have any more mid potions? Oh, we have 28 of them. All right. Um, I don't really need health. I just need MP. Let's see if we can get past this guy then. Looking for Azula? She just she's just through here. Well, are you gonna let me through or not? How do how, how the hell do I? Oh, okay. I thought I was gonna have to fight that guy. I guess not. All right. Uh, in that case, let's see what I, what do I want to do? Um. All right. So what we're gonna do is we are going to. Use a, first of all, we're going to use a, um, a shelter to get all of our stuff back. I think there's a boss coming up, if I had to, if I had to guess. All right, and yeah, all right, so let's see if we can beat this guy. Huh? What's that? Oh. Hold it! When I said she's through here, I meant you gotta go through me first. What do you think I was flexing my muscles and looking all intimidating for? Well, to be fair, if you were a regular boss fight, you wouldn't have just let me save first. I would think you want me to fight you first, but okay, I guess. Alright, uh, let me turn on the lights here real quick. I'm surprised his boss let me save before fighting him. Okay. Uh, well, boss time. All right. Uh, first thing we're going to do is we are going to... What the hell is that? Oh, for the love of... Okay. Well, let's use haste on Chrono. And then we are going to use... Let's try... Let's try using lightning first and see how that gets us. I'll just use cat attack. Okay. That did it. Oh, nice. His defense gets lowered by electric shocks. I will definitely keep that in mind. Defense boosted when attacked. Oh, seriously? Okay, so yeah, we're gonna have to use lightning attacks then. All right, so let's use uh, Thunder Clomp. 
And I'm going to use haste again. On Marl. Nice. 882. Wow. Okay, yeah. We definitely want to use thunder attacks first. Alright. Oh, that's going to do a lot of damage, isn't it? Eh, that didn't do that much. Uh... Alright, so let's do Thunderclomp again. And I'm gonna use Aura actually. On uh on um on Ayla. 1000, wow. That's doing quite a lot, I'm surprised. Here we go. Electric discharge Oh, that's bad. Okay, maybe we don't wanna do that. Uh yikes. That okay, maybe we don't wanna spam electric attacks then. I'll use it occasionally, because it is lowering his defense, but uh, I, need, I need to be careful. Defense boosted when attacked. Okay, I see how this is. Alright, uh... Lightning. Cat attack. I'm gonna use haste on, uh... Ayla. There we go. So yeah, electric attacks lowers defense, whereas normal attacks raise it. Gotcha. Alright, Aura Whirl. Cat attack. We're fighting two bosses in this episode. Interesting. Alright, 258. Yeah, I need to be careful about doing that. Alright, uh... Let's use Thunder Clomp again. Try using ice. See how that does. 140? Seriously? Alright, yeah. We need to use electric attacks then. 261. Not bad. Okay, yeah. I understand how this works. Alright, so lightning. Uh, I'm actually going to use an item. I'm going to use a mid ether on... Uh, or no, I'm going to use a... Uh, Mid potion on, or actually, I'll use a regular potion on Chrono, and I will use. Uh, hmm. I doubt it's gonna work. Let's try it. Allure. I thought that wouldn't work. All right. Well, that did nothing. Oh, seriously? Oh, and here it comes. Ow. That did a lot. All right. Uh, kiss. Yeah, we need to use Aura Whirl immediately. Oh, I can't. Crap. Oh, crap. All right. Uh, this is bad. All right. Um, I can't use electric attacks. This isn't good. Because I can't, because Chrono can't do anything right now. And I don't know, I don't know how to fix that. Uh, uh, can I use something? Can I restore a status effect or something? I don't know. Oh, Marl's almost dead. Crap. All right, there we go. All right, lightning. Aura. Kiss. I need to use this a couple times. Yeah, I need to spend some time healing because I'm not doing great. Alright, uh, lightning. Cat attack. Or, uh, actually, no, I'll just use haste again. Actually, no, uh, here. Here we go. Uh oh. Yikes. Dang it. Right, he's definitely weak to thunder attacks. That's useful to know. Alright. Uh Thunder Clomp. Or uh Alright. Gotta be almost dead. Come on. Oh, there we go. Nice. Got him. <laughs> almost dead. There we go. That wasn't a super hard boss. You just had to use electric attacks mainly. Earn a lot of XP. Tech points. Miles level increased. Can we save again? Oh, we can. Thank you, game. Appreciate it. All right, let's head up here. 
Yep, time for some hydration. Ugh. All right. Thank you, Shivas. Appreciate it. All right. Let's see what's over here. Looks like we're at the top of the castle now. Oh, come on, game. I just fought a boss. Do you mind? Good thing I saved first. All right. Uh, cat attack. Lightning two. And aura. Actually, using lightning two is probably a mistake. Yeah. Whoops. Yeah, I should have just used lightning one. <laughs> oh, well. All right. Got a feather at least. Uh... Oh, for the love of God! Um... Thunderclomp, Aura. Wretched Cure. Because I, I believe Ayla's in death range because of this stupid dragon. Nice. Alright, uh, Thunderclomp again. Uh, I guess I'll use haste. I don't know. If you're still not dead, I'll just use haste. Okay, you're dead. Goodbye. Nice. What the hell, game? What the hell is that for? Alright. Lightning 2. Um, I guess I'll use kiss on Chrono. Alright, there we go. Nice. Lightning 2 again. Gandillo kick. Can you please die? Nice. Uh, ice, I guess. There we go. Get out of here. If, if another two spawn, I swear to God. Okay, well, you can't go up there, so... God, we just fought a boss. Do you mind? Uh, I don't need to do anything ridiculously uh, exquisite for this guy. because There's only one of them, so I'll just attack him. Okay, and dead. Nice. Got a feather. All right, what's over here? Oh, there's a lot of switches. Okay. What does this one do? Ha ha! Looks like we pressed it in the right order. Actually, we did not. Whoops! Alright, uh, let's try that again. Alright. Is this a save point? It is a save point. Alright, so I'm actually going to switch my party around a little bit. Um, yeah, I want to I wanna use... Uh... No, I just, I, never mind. I'm good. Uh, yeah, let's, let's actually stick with this. This is fine. But I do want to save. Unnatural selection. I love that. All right, so what... Oh, sorry. So that was definitely the right one. Oh, but now it... Okay. I guess we have to fight these two. Uh, lightning two. Ow! That is going to do a lot of damage. Crap. Or, uh... Uh, cat attack, I guess. There we go. Get out of here. Right. Lightning. Almost at MP. All right, I'm going to use a mid ether on Chrono. Actually, oh, we're all almost at MP. Crap. That boss really drained us. All right, let's just attack him like normal. We can... Oh, nope, that's not going to work. Crap, I might have made a mistake. Might have made a mistake, because I thought he was within death range, and he is not. We definitely are going to want to use lightning after this. All right, so lightning. I'm going to use kiss on Marl, and I'll just attack. Get out of here. Thank you. How do we get in? Oh, okay. I was like, how do we get in there? That's how. Alright, well, that's nice. Don't press that button. 
If we have to fight those stupid dragons again. Okay, thank God. All right, what's over here? Uh-oh. Who are you? At last, the final confrontation. It was but a matter of time. Will it be we reptiles who inherit the earth or you soft-skinned apes? Strong live, weak die. Ayla, just fight. I should have healed. I really should have healed. Crap. All right, well, this is not going to go well. Hear that lovely voice? You'll soon be hearing it more than you'd ever wish. Okay. Uh, well, I'm going to use this opportunity, actually, to go back a little. Oh, wait. We might... Uh, I'm a little worried about this, but I'm going to try and go back and save and heal up. Who was this one? Yeah, there we go. Alright, so what we're going to do is we are going to use... Um, a shelter. Actually, no. I want to switch my party first. I feel like... I feel like Robo is probably better for this part. And what we're going to do is we're going to use a... Um, we're going to use a shelter. Yep, there we go. And we're going to save. Nope. Because I feel like another boss is coming up. I didn't mean to do that! Are you kidding me, game? Can I run? Ah. Uh... I didn't mean to do that. Come on. That's just annoying. Seriously? Seriously. Ah. Uh, that is just stupid. God. If I die on, on the boss fight, I'm going to be supremely annoyed. Oh, great. Ah, this is annoying. Please die. Thank you. All right, let's, uh, let's try that again and go up to the boss. What I presume to be the boss anyway. All right, let's see what this is. What the hell? Damnable red star. Fall, why don't you? Stain the earth red. Even should it prove our fate to die, we will not relinquish this world to the likes of you. This black tyranna will have the honor of wiping you filthy apes from existence forever. Mwahaha. All right, boss fight, I presume. Yep, boss time. Let's go. Alright, uh, first things first, I'm going to use a kiss. And I guess I have to... Okay, they're both... Alright, let's try using lightning too. See what that does. I'm also going to use a mid ether on uh, Clono real quick. Psychokinesis. What is that going to do? Ow! What the hell? 16, lol. All right. Uh, oh, Jesus. Okay, maybe I should have brought Marl in here now that I think about it. Thunderclomp. And I will use Bobo Tackle. That did nothing. Really? So, uh, I guess I have to hit the other guy then? I don't really know. Uh, let's try Thunderclomp again on this guy. Alright, let's try that. Okay, yeah, we're definitely supposed to hit that guy. Although, I feel like there has to be a way we can hit the other guy, too. 77 is a lot. Okay, yeah, this is bad. We definitely am gonna... I'm definitely gonna want... Holy crap! Okay, that's bad. Um... Oh, please don't kill me. Alright, uh, lightning two. I did so much damage. Alright. How do I hit? Uh. Ow. Alright, uh, 
Thunder Clomp. Uh, I, I guess I'll use Cure. No, I don't really. I'll use Heal Beam. Just because everyone could use a heal. Actually, eh, that wasn't the best idea, but whatever. There we go. I'll take it, I guess. Oh, seriously? He could use sleep? Ah. Oh. Alright. Well, at least I can use kiss in order to wake him up. Alright, get out of here. That didn't do that much damage. That attack does a lot of damage, though. Yikes. Uh, lightning. Kiss. I wonder if I'm doing this right, because I feel like I might not be. Rocket Punch. I love Rocket Punch. That's a cool attack. Uh, Psychokinesis. God damn it. I want to see if I can use some attacks with... Alright, so let's use Rendillo Kick. And let's try using uh, Cyclone Sweep. Okay, Supersonic Spin it is. There we go. Oh, I actually did a lot. Five? Wait, why is it saying five? I don't like that. Four, uh-oh. Is everyone healed up? Because I feel like this is going to do a lot of damage. All right. Let's try using this again. Three. I don't like this. Two. I don't like where this is going. This is probably going to do a crap ton of damage, isn't it? Sap. Oh, not this attack again. That's annoying. Oh, dead. Okay. One. Right, there. Yeah, I need, I need to use physical attacks on this guy. Zero. All right, how much damage? Seriously, dude? Really? That did so much damage. There we go. Alright, there we go. Alright, uh... Let's see, Gobo Tackle. Drill kick. Yeah, I need to use physical attacks against this guy. Alright. This guy has a lot of defense, though. That's not good. Right, cleave. Alright. Jeez, that guy has so much defense. What is his weakness? It must be something I didn't bring into the battle. All right, uh, Wind Slash, I guess. Let's try that. Eh, not, not much. Robo Tackle. Okay, that did a decent amount. All right, uh, there. Cyclone Sweep. I can't use Cyclone Sweep, but I can use Supersonic Spin, which probably isn't a good idea, actually. I just realized. Oh, well. There we go. How much defense does he have? Jeez, lower his defense if he can... Oh, he's not... He's doing this attack again. Crap. All right. All right. Am I all healed up? Uh, almost. Ayla could use a little more. Actually, I'm, I'm pretty much healed up, so... Let's just hit him with everything we got until then. There we go. Uh, Cyclone, let's try that. Alright, come on. Could actually use some mid ethers now that I think about it. Alright, uh, let's use... Let's use some ethers. Alright. 
crap. Uh, hold on. Yeah, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use some ethers at this point because I I definitely need to heal up on my uh, I get some more MP back. All right, there we go. How much HP does this guy have? Jeez. This guy has so much HP, it's annoying. There we go. At least Robo Tackle seems to do a decent amount of damage. And zero. Here we go. Alright. Matt Big Viewbot tuning in. <laughs> Welcome, Matt. I appreciate it. I am doing okay, I actually. Um, right now, I am using... I am fighting this this guy. I don't know what his name is off the top of my head. Uh, I can check in a moment. I love the I love the, uh, <laughs> the robot emote. That's awesome. Uh, doesn't actually say his name, so I guess we're just fighting a boss. Ow! That is going to do a lot of damage. Really, Matt? <laughs> I didn't mean to use kiss on myself. That was a mistake. Dang it. All right. Can you please die? All right. Uh, I want to use kiss. There we go. Jesus Christ. How much HP does this guy have? All right. Uh, I'm using. I'm gonna use another mid ether. Uh, this time on Robo. Here we go. Alright. Storing power. Alright, so. Mandillo kick. Leave. He's gotta be almost dead. Come on. Alright. Uh, Cure Beam. Mandillo kick. This is just taking forever, honestly. It's not even like a super hard boss. It's just taking forever. I feel like his, his weakness is, 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 is something we don't have. I don't know why. All right. Just because we, we haven't found it yet. And I feel like it's just an element. We, like it's probably ice or fire, which is uh, Marl or Luca. Can you please die? I would really appreciate it. I'm just gonna attack. 466. All right, now we're doing actually more damage by just attacking normally, honestly. All right, come on. Finally, get out of here. Bono's level increased. Ayla's level increased. Robo's level increased. Ha ha. You know what Ayla's also got, Matt? Ayla's also got good fighting skills because she took out that giant monster. No, it can't be. Could the heavens have truly sided with the apes? What do you mean apes? Robo is literally a robot. Listen, primates, and again, Robo's a robot. And let it be known for all time, we reptiles fought proudly to the bitter end. Ayla, no. Huh? First, a great fiery stone will crash to the earth. Its flames will soon spread to scorch every corner of the land. Then the chill will begin to creep across the blackened plains, ushering in a long, cruel age of ice and snow. Thanks for the posture check, service. I appreciate it. Ha ha ha. A fitting end to our age indeed. Mwa ha ha ha. Lavos. Lavos? But that's impossible. Uh-oh. How is there a Lavos here? I thought Magus summoned him. Well, this doesn't look good, that's for sure. Guys, if that thing is really going to cause the Ice Age, we might want to get out of here. We have a time portal and everything. We might want to go. Also, I like this scene. This is some great SNES graphics right here. I don't like where this is going. Ugh, ooh. Ayla people word. La mean fire. Vos mean big. 
Really? That's what Lavos means? Lay fire? So big fire, or fire big. Big fire, that's what Lavos means? <sighs> okay then. I find that a little stupid, but so be it. Ayla! Kino! Oh, hey, the guys with the, uh, the dactyls. Hurry, Lavos falls soon. All right, Dactyl. So wait, is Lavos an asteroid then? I, I guess he is. Kino, hurry. Ayla, what you do? Come, Azala, come. No, this is the will of the earth. Hmm. Ayla, hurry. Azala, Ayla, not forget. Take. Take? What take? Take care of this world. Uh-oh. So I guess Lavos is an asteroid. Boom! <laughs> well, that's... Ooh, that's Lavos' scream, all right. We heard that when uh, we died to Magus. Yikes. Okay, I guess Lavos is an asteroid. That's bad. That's really bad. It seems Lavos made his first appearance here and not in the year 600. So, I guess that means Lavos is the asteroid that killed all the dinosaurs then. Lavos, huge. Chrono, fight that? Chrono, we go place, we go place, Lavos fall. I like how the little dots are all the characters. Lavos should be weaker now. We should go and see. Well, at least we're alive. Tyranno Lair Ruins. Well, I guess we're not going back there anymore. At least we can ride the Dactyls again. Alright, uh, let me just check something real quick. Apparently that guy was... Oh, Black Tyrannos. Okay, fair enough. One second. Oh, we actually need to explore the wreckage. Never mind. Alright, so Tyranno Lair Ruins. Oh, there's a time gate. A gate is formed. Lavos fast, deep under Earth now. These gates are likely the result of the energy radiating from Lavos placing strains in the surrounding time space. What wrong, Chrono? Want, want fight Lavos? Go here, no? Uh, I don't know if I want to fight a giant asteroid quite yet. I'm only level 25. Well, at the very least, let's uh, go through the time gate to head back to the end of time. Oh, wait. The hell? My time gyro reads 12,000 BC. We are still in the very distant past. Chrono, where is this? Where this place? I have no idea. Small kale. Well, I guess we're in the Ice Age now. Hold on. Alright, cool. Um, Alright, so let's save real quick. The Magic Kingdom. So where the hell are we? I, I guess this is what happened after Lavos... Uh, I guess this is what happened after Lavos uh, crashed into the Earth. He created an Ice Age. There's a certain place we're looking for. I gotta find it. Uh, where is it? There's like a town around here, apparently, according to the guide. But I do not know where it is. I do not know where that is. That's not it. 
That's a small cave that we came out of. Oh, here it is. Nice. Skyway, I guess. I think this is where we're supposed to go. What the hell? And and Hasa, I guess, is what that's called. Whoa. Welcome to Enhasa, Zeal's city of dreams. We seek enlightenment within the bliss of sleep. Hmm, you are not of us, are you? No, we're certainly not. All right, there should be an inn around here somewhere. You are most unusual visitors. Am I walking or walking? Am I waking or is this, a, or is this but a continuation of my dream? Regardless of that, I welcome you to Zeal. Her majesty, Queen Zeal rules this magic kingdom. She's without peer in beauty or grace. This is the magic kingdom of zeal where dreams can be made reality but nothing in this world comes free there's always a price to be paid i don't like the sound of that we owe our prosperity to her majesty the queen after the king died she encouraged the development of our kingdom's magical prowess which has led us to great advancements <laughs> sleeping sleeping on the job all right there should be a shop around here somewhere the world you see with your eyes may well differ completely from the one I see with mine. There are many different worlds as there are observers. Never assume that only, that only those things which you can see are, or touch are real. That's actually, a real. that's actually a really good life advice. Wow. Truths exist in dreams. The world exists in me. Do you believe in such things as fate? Do you think it's possible our lives are, inter are predetermined? That's getting really existential, but I guess I could go into that. I mean, I do believe that there is a little bit. There, there, there definitely, I, I feel like for the most part, in general, I don't believe in fate that much. I like to think that we choose our own destiny. But I, I also do like to think that maybe some things were meant to happen, so to speak, and just some things just kind of work out as they should. But for the most part, yeah, I, I like to think that we kind of choose our own destiny as humans. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So you're a believer too. Uh, hold on. Can I talk to you again? Yes, I do. No, that's ridiculous. That's none of your business. Uh, no, that's ridiculous. Yes, it is, isn't it? We are masters of our own destinies. Speaking of which, I believe there may be a doorway of destiny in this very place. Interesting. This is a weird place for sure. The city of Kajar, the high seat of the magical research, lives on the lies on the western edge, or lies on the edge of the western continent. The airship, the Blackbird, is maintained there as well. All right, where's the... Sh oh, where are you? Hmm. Do you wish to speak with us? What wrong? That animal for eat? Taste good? Stop assuming we're eating everything! Mm. The Black Winds howl. What? One among you will shortly perish. Well, that's not cool to say to us. Is that true? Let me calculate the probability. Hmm? Why would he say such a thing? Yeah, that's that's weird. Strange boy, but not bad boy. I disagree. I think I personally think saying you're gonna die soon is kind of a jerk thing to say to someone. Wait, what? Did that heal us? Oh, that did heal us. Nice. This is a front of recovery. Rest your wearied mind and body within, traveler. Well, thank you. I wonder what's within the northern shrine. No doubt the key to unlock its seal is held at the, pl at the palace, but the entry there is strictly forbidden in, her, in the name of Her Majesty the Queen. The Queen's palace sits at the heart of our kingdom. She watches over all the world from its high vantage point. It's because of that that we can sleep our days away in peace. Ugh. I don't. I can't really yawn on command, sadly. I am Doreen. Seek the hidden path and open the doors of knowledge, each in turn. Okay. The door to the Northern Shrine is sealed by a powerful force. Even we, the Enlightened Ones, lack the means to open it. The Queen has sealed away the great elemental weapons and armors, forged with the power of the sun in the Shrine of the North. You can see its entrance to the northern, on the Northern Continent, but no one is allowed inside it now. I don't know how we get over there, but okay, thanks for telling us. All right, well, let's definitely go to the shop. We have come to do business. Yes. Uh, we definitely want more. Let's get some high potions, actually. Uh, 
I'll get five high potions. And I'm going to get, like, 20... E I don't want to get that many ethers. I'll get 10 ethers. Uh, we don't really need shelters at this point. Athenian water, we're fine. Panacea, we could use some more. I'll get, uh, I'll get, like, five panaceas. High potion, we're good. Uh, yeah, we're good. Thank you, I appreciate that. What do you, like, some, like, mini ethers or whatever, but what are you gonna do? Oh, what do you have to say? This is the Magic Kingdom of Zeal, we're dreaming- Oh, we already talked to you. Alright, well, that's interesting, I suppose. How do we get over there? Land bridge. Oh, okay, that's how. Uh, where exactly are we supposed to go now, though? Hold on. One second. All right, so apparently we want to head north. So, I guess we'll take the land bridge, then. Alright. So, yeah, apparently we want to head north now. No? Question mark? Hmm, now I'm confused. That's the Skyway. I'll definitely hydrate. Yeah, that place is weird. The Zeal place, the kingdom... That place is pretty weird. Alright, um, I am confused as to where we're supposed to go. Uh, so give me a second. <laughs> uh, how do we get to the place to the north? Hmm, this is interesting. Maybe it went to the wrong, like, place, question mark? Oh, I guess we have to go over here. My bad. This land bridge is probably where we're supposed to go. No, that's... Hmm. No, I don't want to go... Dang it. <laughs> Dang it. I didn't want to do that. Because now I'm back here. I don't know how to get over there, though. Because we're in a house in Hassa now. And we need to head north, apparently. No? How do we... Hmm. This is very confusing. We... Oh, wait. We're in a different place. Yeah, I think we're in a different place now, actually. Hold up. All right, let's try heading north, I suppose. No, we're in, we're still in the same place. Uh, what, is there another land bridge over here or something? No, there's a cave, though. Where are we supposed to go? I'm so confused. Hold up. My phone would open, that'd be nice. It says, head north of Manhasa, take the land bridge and head north again, and take the sky bridge back into Zeal to find a new area up in the clouds. I have no idea what that means. Seriously, I, I don't know what that means. And I don't see anything else, so I, I guess we were on the right track over there. I'm so confused. <laughs> uh, there's nothing over there. I guess I don't think so. Can't go through there. Hmm. Hmm. This is this is definitely interesting. Skyway. It says head north of Manhasa and take the land bridge. What do we... We can't... Hmm. So what, we go over here then? Head north of Manhasa, take the land bridge. Then head north again and take the sky bridge. Oh, well this is different. Oh, okay, now we're in a different place, I understand. At least I think so. Okay, now I understand. It's, it's, it's connected by a, by a different... Okay, I got really confused. Sorry about that. I don't think we wasted too much time anyway, so we're good. 
Got about an hour left of streaming, by the way, just so you guys know. Alright, so now we have a new area over here. We have uh, Kajar. Actually, I probably should save first, now that I think about it. Yeah, let's do that. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, Kajar. What do you have to say? This is the magic city of Kajar. We perform research in the magical arts to help further Her Majesty's plans to deliver our kingdom with even greater glory. Your power differs from ours. It's difficult to describe, but in you I sense a strange kindness. Why does that make me think of... Never mind. Those lacking magic are known as the Earthbound Ones. Okay, that is a little ironic considering there is an RPG that is also called Earthbound. I'm sure there's no relation, but... They have always lived beneath the clouds. It's only fitting. After all, they lack our talents. Well, that's a little rude. Come on. That's like, that's like some, that's like some, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, not existential, but otherworldly racism. That's not cool. Come on. My, you have an unusual aura. You possess the gift too. Yours seems very primitive compared to ours though. You poor thing. What the hell is wrong with you people? Come on. How is it that we came to have the powers we do? We, why, why do some possess the gift while others lack it? It is a conundrum. Seems like a conundrum indeed. Oh, is that a shop? Oh, nice. We can get some more stuff. Uh, I don't think we need anything, though. Uh, yeah, we're good. Thanks, though. I have platinum armor, too, but I didn't hear Majesty's permission to sell it. Ooh, that actually sounds pretty useful. That's the Sun Temple, which you see on the Southern Sky Isle. The Sunstone, once our primary source of power, was enshrined there. However, the temple was sealed up along with the Northern Shrine with the turned our, to our new energy source. The queen claimed we need no need for the energy of the, of the tired old sun. Interesting. I guess that's over there. What do you guys have to say? We've been seeing a great deal of young Lord Janus lately. Before, he scarcely showed his face, but now he paces around quite often, always looking upset. What tempest must rage in, Lord Janus, in young Lord Janus's head? His only friend, other than his sister, is that cat that follows him about. His Majesty Queen Zeal has two children, Lady Shala and young Lord Janus. Lady Shala is an incredible child with extraordinary magical powers. With such a gift, her life must be all ease and luxury. For some reason, I doubt that's true. Are you Janus? The construction of the Ocean Palace has fallen behind schedule. An everlasting, peace be or an everlasting palace between the waves. It'll be a sight to see when it's finished. Behold, that out the window is the great blackbird, built by Belfasar, the guru of reason. To see it soar across the sky, you'd think it alive. The guru is a genius. Well, I can't really see it outside of the windows, but okay. The earthbound ones are being allowed to work on the construction of the ocean palace. It seems even they have their purpose. The structure you see deep beneath the waves is below is the ocean palace, a symbol of our queen's greatness. The palace is the beacon of light which will guide us to a brighter future. All praise the great wondrous Queen Zeal. Okay, interesting. What's in the other room? Oh, this is probably Janus. Can't talk to you. I heard a strange prophet has come to the palace. I do not know the details, but I heard he has powers most uncanny. Zeal's progress stems from our new energy source. Its power far surpasses that of the sun's elemental energy. The gurus of light, time, and reason dwell in zeal. Their knowledge and skills without equal. I heard Lady Shala's powers far surpass those of her mother. Is it a weapon to surpass Metal Gear? I probably shouldn't be making that reference considering I've literally never played a Metal Gear game in my life. Then there's her brother, young Lord Janus. He's of royal blood as well, of course but doesn't seem to have the faintest trace of magical ability. I've been working to fashion a capsule that will enhance one's magical skill, but my precious products have been disappearing in recent days. It must be that naughty Mew that took them. They do so love their pranks. He's no doubt hitting them all about. How can I work like this? A guru once told me that the Sunstone once held all, held, held all nearly the infinite energy of our sun. That's quite a lot of energy. Over time, that energy slowly depleted, and it turned into the lightless moonstone. 
I wouldn't call a moonstone lightless. I mean, the moon still shines in the sky. It's not as bright as the sun. You can't blind yourself by looking at it, but still. Know you this, traveler? The moonstone can be restored to a glorious sunstone it left to bask in the sun's warm light. But it would require, but, but such would require eons. None of us will ever witness such that gorgeous glow again. Interesting. What do you have to say? Water summons wind. Wind makes fire dance. Interesting. What about you? Are you going to talk? No? Okay, then. Oh, that capsule's not been completed yet. Too bad, eh? Ha ha ha. That's a little rude. Anything over here? Oh, I think I already talked to these guys. All right. Is there anything else to do in here or not really? Okay, we have to go to the ship then. Gotcha. All right, well, it was nice talking to these guys at least. All right, so yeah, the Blackbird. What the hell? What do you have to say? Why are you here? All is well with the Blackbird, I presume? She is fully operational, Lord Dalton. Of course she is, you blundering idiot. Were she not, we'd all be in trouble. You, what are you doing here? I just was wandering around. Hmm? Those clothes. You must be the ones the prophet said would come to interfere. Ah, uh, I have no, no quarrel with you. I think I shall watch for the time being and see how he pays his hand, plays his hand. Not that I suspect he'll tip his cards so easily. Ha! Seriously, I have no quarrel with you, dude. None. Um, all right. One second. Alright, uh, nothing else to do here, then. Um. Well, water summons wind, wind makes fire dance. I guess that's an order of some kind. Small cave? Is that where we're supposed to go? I don't know what that is, but... Let's see what's over here. Huh, I guess we're up here now. Hold on a second. Okay, I guess we're supposed to go up there. Oh no, wait, no we're not. We're in the wrong place, hang on. Crap, sorry guys. All right, well apparently what we're supposed to do is um. We have to go back to the, uh, to Kajar. Seriously? Well, the game crashed. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, I hope we don't have to redo too much. That would be really annoying. I don't know what happened there, but the game crashed. Seems to be a running theme here. All right, well, there we go. Let's just get it back up real quick. My sincerest apologies. All right, uh, what happens if we resume? Oh, we just resumed from here. Okay, that's cool. All right, did we already encounter... Do we have to do go through this cutscene again or no? The blackbird is a symbol of Zeal's advancement. Okay, cool. We're good. Okay, we didn't lose that much progress then. Thank God. I don't know why the game crashes so often. That's really weird. Hold up. All right, what we need to do is... Um... We need to go, what is this? It says, Hend to Kajar. You may notice a blinking blue dot at the upper right portion of the screen. I don't know what that's talking about. I literally don't know what that means. Um, go to the upper right hand door and check the bottom right of the screen for, a, for a, a, an item. Okay, well that's nice. Oh, nice. I got a speed capsule. That's useful. All right. Well, let's use that then. Uh, let's use that on Robo. Excellent. Cool. That's useful. Um, Hold on. I guess we have to open the books. 
Although I don't know what, what, what that means though. It says it says we have to Huh? I don't know what I don't know what it says open the books. Um water top left wind bottom right fire on the north side of the table desk summon new vendor. Oh, okay, it's referring to the okay, hang on. I think I know what it's referring to. I think it's over here. Yeah, here it is. Or no wait, nope. Over there. Yeah, it's referring to this, if I had to guess. Well, I think I did it in the wrong order. Okay, well, that didn't quite work. That's fire. I don't want to do that. How do I open the other books? It says... Okay, well, I did it in the wrong order, so let's try that again. You have to open the books in the right order, basically. I'm also going to save here, just because I don't want to have the game crash again. Alright, cool. All right, so, good. The fire reset. So, water is in the top left. Cool. And then, wind is in the bottom right. Which I guess is over here. And then fire is over there. Oh, nice! The secret passage. What's this? Obtain an unidentifiable object. Okay, then. But inside is a black gemstone. Huh. Well, that's useful. It all began eons ago when man's ancestors stumbled upon a shard of, a stra of strange red rock. Its power was beyond human comprehension. It cultivated dreams and gave birth to love and hate. Only time will tell how it ends. Interesting. Very, very interesting. All right. Uh, I guess we should get out of here now. Um, we should probably equip that gemstone, actually, now that I think about it. Can Chrono equip it? It's the uh, black rock. Nope. Uh, can Robo equip it? I don't know what, 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 what kind of... Uh, I don't know what kind of... Uh, what's it? Um... I don't know what kind of uh, item it is. Black gemstone. There we go. Well, that actually lowers our, our thing, so I don't want that. Uh, hold on. Can Marl equip it? That, that lowers my magic a little bit, but apparently we get access to a new triple attack, so I, I guess I'll take it. Sure, why not? Alright, so now we need to head east from Kajar. And enter the cave. Okay, so now we're entering the cave. Gotcha. I'm gonna save again. This is really interesting, actually. I'm liking this area quite a bit. Alright, so now we have to go up here. I just wanted to get that item first, I suppose. Right. Go through here. Small cave. There we go. Alright, let's see. And we're up to the Zeal Palace. This is the Queen's Palace in the center of the Magic Kingdom of Zeal, which is to say, this is the center of the universe. Don't, don't need to get that cocky, jeez. The Queen's two children, Lady Shala and Lord Janus, get along so well. If only long, young Lord Janus would open up to others. That pendant of yours... It looks like Lady Shallows, but it doesn't glow like hers. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, it's through here. Beings that are born of dreams must always return to them in the end. But at, the, but at times, people's dreams and prayers call upon the power of Lavos, uh-oh, and make them an, an are made reality. That doesn't sound good. Uh, what's over here? That man o appeared only recently, but he earned the queen's trust quickly with the startlingly, startlingly accurate predictions. His origins are a mystery. He's not one of us enlightened ones, but nor is he an earthbound one. From where could such a man have come? Were you aware that Belpazar, the guru of reason, maintains secret chambers in Anahasa and Kajar? 
I did not know that. Well, I think I found one of the secret chambers, to be fair. You, you'd do best to speak with the queen or the gurus if you wish to learn of the mammon machine in the ocean palace. But just between you and I, I'd pl not place much faith in any answers to her majesty gave you right now. She's been different as of late. Different how? The queen's council, Lord Dalton, was in charge of the ocean palace's construction until a wandering prophet arrived and took over. Lord Dalton's in a foul mood, foul mood these days. Best avoid him if you can. I noticed. The completion of the Ocean Palace will secure the everlasting glory for the Kingdom of Zeal. There will be no more fear or sadness, only eternal peace. A lot of other uh, people have said something similar before, and it never worked. This way will take you to the bedchambers. Okay. The Queen must have borne a great deal of pain and sorrow in silence. Progress requires equal sacrifice. Much, has, must, much must have been given to allow Zeal to attain the glory it now knows. Interesting. It's through here. Bunch of beds. Lady Shala's pendant was made from the same redstone as the Mammon machine. When she prays to the device, the pendant grows with an unearthly light. Huh. I wonder if that's similar to our pendant. Interesting. Shala! Oh, Janus, you've returned. Is something wrong? Oh, that's Janus! You're a jerk! <laughs> the Black Winds. You feel the foreboding too? Don't worry, it will be all right. Here, keep this close. What is it? It's an amulet containing my prayers. If something should happen, it will keep you safe. I wish that I could return with you always, but Mother has other plans. That's not our mother. She looks like her, but she's not the same inside. Hmm. Even still, forgive me, Janus. Pardons, your highness. Okay. The queen requests your immediate presence at the Ocean Palace. Very well. Well then, Janus, I must be on my way. Oh, who might you be? We're just some random travelers. Forgive me, my lady, but we must hurry. If we're late, I fear I'll be, well, you know the queen. Of course, my apologies. I'm surprised they ignored us like that. What are you, are you still a jerk? Go away. Noted, still a jerk. <laughs> Not sure what's up with Janus, but all right. What's over here then? Hmm. This must be the continuation of the story. Hmm, interesting. Well, I'm not getting in there. Her Majesty said that she had business at the Ocean Palace. None may pass until her return. Your pendant, it looks identical to Lady Shala's. I heard that when Lady Shala communes with the Mammon Machine, her pendant gl glows with a strange light. Okay. Hmm. Can we go in here? Strange. Why no move? This door appears to be a highly effective security system. You think? <laughs> I guess we can't go in there. Interesting. Interesting. I want to explore a little bit more, though. Listen to me. The Earth is alive and always has been. She changes slowly so you never see it. From flat lands into mountains, from mountains into seas. A way may someday open even to the Forbidden Shrine in the north or to the Sun Temple, but it could take untold years. This way leads to the Queen's audience chamber. Well, then what's over here, then? Oh, thank you. This way leads to the Mammon Machine Chamber. I want to talk to these guys first. They say that Gaspar, the guru of time, continues his work on some deserted island. He strives to make a time egg or some such nonsense, but no one has seen him for years. Even Balthazar, the one who designed the Blackbird in the Ocean Palace, has vanished. How strange that the three gurus who guided Zeal to its present glory have all disappeared at once. That is a little strange, yeah. The Wandering Prophet is amazing. Every prophecy to escape his lips has come to pass. It's as though he knows the events to come. Unnerving, is it not? Oh, Itchy, could you scratch my back? Uh, sure? Oh, wonderful. Uh, oh, right there, you got it. Okay, that's a little creepy, not gonna lie. I will definitely hydrate after that. Not gonna lie, that is slightly unnerving. No. Ah. Woo, thank you. Discovered the new scratching spot. What the hell does that mean? That just sounds disturbing. Okay, that's very, very weird. 
I don't really know what to say about that, honestly. Uh, I guess we should try going in here. The Prophet's aura is clouded with hatred and sorrow. If he does not free himself of these emotions, he'll destroy himself and those he loves along with him. Beyond lies the Mammon Machine Chamber. You can feel the glorious energy of Lavos surging from it. The Mammon Machine. You came to see it? Not necessarily, but sure. I thought as much. Can you feel the flow of the mighty Lavos' power? Oh, it brings tears to my eyes. I really don't think that's a good thing, but okay. What the hell? If the Mammon Machine is moved to the Ocean Palace, we can extract even more energy from Lavos. The dream of eternal life will be made possible. Oh, Almighty Queen, our kingdom will reign for all eternity. This is the front of Zeal's power, the Mammon Machine. It draws and magnifies the limitless power of Lavos. Oh, that pendant. It looks like just like Lady Shal is. When she clutches her pendant and prays to the Mammon Machine, the pendant radiates a strange light. Oh, it's Lavos. Okay, that actually makes a little more sense, especially considering it's, it was an asteroid. Like, um, I guess it's, it's similar to Lava, because it was, you know, uh, uh, what's her name? It's almost as if she was speaking to the device in a language only the two of them can understand. Uh, Ayla, sorry. It, it's like Ayla said, it's, it, it's Lava and Vos, because big fire, or fire big, I guess. I mean, technically, it should be Vosla, then. You don't say Leva, do you? Good point. I didn't think I didn't think it was that kind of. I didn't think they were being clever like that. Although to be fair, this game in, in, in its entirety has been very clever. So, operating the Mammon Machine requires magic powerful enough to re to regulate the energy the machine extracts. Accepting the Gurus, the Gurus, Lady Shala is the only one with such power. The three Gurus constructed the Mammon Machine from a reddish stone that had been kept in the royal treasury for generations. The Guru of Life, Mel Melquire, was in charge of the plans and conducted a great deal of research on the nature of Lavos. But now, well, I'm sure you know the rest. I know a lot of the rest, considering Lavos destroys the world! <laughs> Melquire, the Guru of Life, opposed the Queen's plans and dis disappeared shortly after. It pains me to consider some conspiracy maybe at work, but it is terribly suspicious. You're right, Matt. You're right. It is. It is late. It's not Leva. It's Lava. I didn't. I didn't think they were being like that. But that's interesting. I'm gonna save real quick because I have a feeling if we go in there, we will uh, go to the next part of the game. But this is very interesting. I actually really like this. All right, hang on. Save the game. In case our freaking game crashes again. Lavos. Like, we, we, yes, we do know how it ends. He destroys the entire world. Uh, you need to move, though. Thank you. All right, so I guess we should, uh, press that button over there. Oop. Let's try using the pendant. Did anything happen? No? Did that do anything? I feel like it didn't. Hmm. Hold on a second. Where are we supposed to go next? I feel like I'm missing something here. Ah, uh, hang on. Okay, gotcha. All right, well, apparently there's something else I want to do. Um, talk to the girl on the bottom left who's holding a plant. What? What, what girl is that? I don't know which, I don't know who's holding a plant. Uh, I guess down here. What the hell? Her Majesty said she has business at the Ocean Palace. None be passed until her return. I have no idea what what the game what the guide is talking about. A girl with a plant in the bottom left? I don't see it. Oh, is it? It's probably this girl. Do you like plants, Traveler? I mean, I wouldn't say it's my favorite thing ever, but sure. Oh, I love them too. But the queen ordered me to burn this tiny sapling I received from the Guru of Life. He said it was a special tree with powers to restore the earth. Oh, what should I? What shall I do? I wouldn't say burn it. I, I'd say we should probably grow it in secret. Although I think that's actually what the guide says we need to do. 
Yeah, so we have to, yeah, grow in a secret. You're right. Queen's orders, though may, they may be, it wouldn't do to burn a gift from the, from the guru of life. Very well, then. I'll care for it somewhere, safe and secret. Someday it may just help someone else who loves earth and trees. Cool. My, what strange clothes. You must be travelers from afar. Use the front of recovery if you'd like to recuperate. Oh, yeah, I could use that. Thank you. Um. All right, we should be good, then. Let us continue. So I guess, all right, so apparently what we need to do now is we need to head up here. All right, let's see. Oh, the pendant's working. I guess it's because we charged it at that machine earlier. Ayla, go. No, be scared, Chrono. Marl's pendant is most certainly made of the Guru's stone. I guess that's why it can open time gates. I don't like where this is going. Who are you? How did you get in here? We have a pendant. Your Majesty, these are the bringers of disaster of whom I spoke. Indeed, they and the Gurus alike. How dare you outlanders attempt to oppose me? Fools, one and R. Dalton, seize them. Yes, Your Majesty, with pleasure. Golem! Huh? Uh-oh. I think it's boss time. My guess is it's boss time. It's boss time. Halves HP? Really, game? Come on! What? That destroyed me! Uh... Uh, what... Ah, uh, crap, hold on. What the hell was that? That freaking killed me in, like, one hit! Am I under-leveled for this? I swear to God, if I'm under-leveled for this... Dude, what? Okay, I don't know if we're supposed to win this fight. Because this is just... Oh my god. Dude, what the hell? Oh my god. How is it... It has so much more... Oh my lord. Did the... Okay, we were, never mind, we were supposed to lose that fight. I was like, there's no way we can win that fight. Nuh-uh. Mwahaha, fear not. I won't kill you. Not immediately, that is. I'll allow you to sample every type of pain and fear imaginable first. By the time we're through, you'll be begging us to end your suffering. Ah, what a delicious diversion. I don't like the sound of that. I really don't like the sound of this. Hmm, idiots. What will you do, Shala? Let us help them. I don't think it'll be of any use, and you'll be in trouble if you let them escape. Don't worry about me, I'll be fine. And they just might be able to rescue Melchior. Well, thank you, I appreciate that. Especially because we got our asses kicked in, in with, uh, <laughs> from that golem. Are you alright? Quickly, you must flee the palace. And if you can, please, free the Guru of Life. He was sent to the Mountain of Woe for opposing my mother's plan. Please, you must help him. I'm afraid I cannot allow that. Oh, come on, dude! Your meddling tires me. It seems I'll need to put an end to you here. No, you mustn't. Hmm. Don't. Oh, hey, even the jerk is actually helping us. Thank you, I appreciate that. Hmm. Very well, I'll spare their lives. But in return, you will cooperate with me, Shala. Now, show me how it is you came here. I mean, we came through a gate and then a pendant and... Oh yeah, and that too. Hmm, so you came through here. Thanks for making us not walk all the way back here. I appreciate that. Now, Shala, once I throw them in, you will seal the portal shut. N no, you can't make me. You will obey me. Their lives are at stake. I very well. Well, guess we're not going to be able to come back here soon. Oh, well. And the portal is sealed shut. Guess we're not coming back anytime soon. Please forgive me. Oh well. 
Back in the ruins we go. And yep, why would why would the prophet not illuminate us? They take Lavos power. Lavos. Lavos. Sorry, Matt. They take Lavos power. Lavos get weak. Do you recall the crest on the door that the pendant opened? I have seen several of them in my own time. Yeah, I have two, actually. I remember that crest has appeared on the chests, actually, as well. Interesting. Yeah, it appeared there, too. A curious crest is engraved here, and a mysterious force seals it shut. Hmm. Interesting. Let us return to my time. All right, I guess that's where we're going next. Although, I'm wondering if now is a good time to end the stream off. Oh, all right. Apparently, we actually can win that fight, but it doesn't matter. So, I mean, there's not really a point to winning that fight. I guess we can get some experience, but apparently, yeah, it doesn't matter if we... Uh... It doesn't matter if we uh, fight him, if we lose that fight or not. All right, so now we need to head back to the end of time. All right, so let's ride on our uh, dactyls, I guess. All right, back up to uh, the end of time, which I think is over here. Yeah, here we go. Although I do want to... Hold on, I'm going to land somewhere. There we go. Because I want to trade for some stuff. In the uh, hut. In the Ioka hut. I think there's some stuff we can get now. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can probably get some stuff. So give me a second, guys. I want to want to check something real quick. Just trying to double check this. But... Uh, because I think there's something we can get now. Not there. Here we go. All right. So I think we should be able to get the rock helm, which will be nice. So we need to give horn and feather. So horn and feather. Stone helm. Yes. I'll take it. And I don't think we'll be able to get the ruby vest because we need a fang and a feather, but we could try. All right. So fang... And feather. Nice, ruby vest. Thank you. Uh, no, I'm good. All right, so let's equip some of that stuff. Um, I don't know who... I guess we can try the rock helm on Chrono. Stone helm. Ooh, that's quite... That's actually quite a... Uh, that's not that good, actually. Let's see if we can equip it to someone else. Maybe uh, Ayla? No, we can't give it to Ayla. Can we give it to Lika? Yes. Uh, that's not that big of an increase. Uh, yeah, we'll give it to Frog. That works. And what else did we get? The Ruby Vest? I don't know who that is, who that is, who could equip that, but... Oh, that's actually worse for Chrono. Uh, it's better for... It's better for Robo, though, so I'll do that. All right, that sounds good. All right, yeah, I just wanted to go trade, honestly. All right, so now we are going to save the game and head back to the end of time. Uh, now that I think about it, we should probably try to get some more spell levels. So, all right, here we go. So, yeah, Mystic Mountains. We'll have to fight some of these guys again, but that's whatever. All right, let's fight these guys. We can just auto-battle this, honestly. I just realized I'm at one health. Crap, crap, crap. No, I don't want to do that. Crap, that's bad. That's really, really bad. I'm dead. I'm dead. Dang it. I didn't realize I was at one health. Come on, game. Ah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Let's try that again. We'll use a shelter. God damn it. I can't believe that happened. That was... That was... Someone actually... If, 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 any, if anyone's here, someone clipped that. That was actually really embarrassing. <laughs> I, I, am, I am huge dumb. There we go. Yeah, let's use a shelter. Yeah, if someone's here, please clip that, because that was, ooh, that was big dumb. All right, let's try that again. 
when we're not at one health from dying to that stupid golem guy. All right. There we go. Ow. That didn't do that much damage. All right. There we go. Get out of here. Yeah, we, we can just auto battle for this, honestly. Not a huge deal. All right. Love this theme. It's a really good battle theme. Nice. Got a horn. That's nice, I suppose. All right, so let's head back to the end of time. Thank you, Chivas. I appreciate that. <laughs> that was... I cannot believe I made that mistake. That was really, really stupid. All right, back to the end of time we go. Oh, hey, um, some of our portals are closed. That's odd. All right, let's restart our HP and MP. Uh, I guess we should try and fight this guy again. The whole Zeal Kingdom was very odd, yeah. So I was talking to Speccio. Oh, okay. Uh, well, let's, let's switch our party members then. So apparently Ayla cannot learn magic, noted. Um, let's switch it out for Frog and uh, Marl. All right, can anyone learn new magic? Uh, sure, we'll, we'll get some practice. All right, well, let's see how much damage he does to us now, now that we're a little higher level. Oh, uh, still a lot. Uh, let's see. Here. There we go. Nice. Right, so let's try beating Speccio again. Dang it. That's so much damage. Lightning. Oh, Chrono's dead. Dang it. All right. Uh, water. Uh, ice, I guess. All right, come on. Please die. Oh, that does so much damage. Jesus. Seriously, how, how am I supposed to beat this guy? Especially when he kills me in basically one hit. Right, how is this going to do? Here. I should have used that on Frog now that I think about it. Dang it. Oh, come on, game. Please let me... Okay. Ah, oh, that does so much damage. I'm definitely not at a high enough level to face the guy again. All right, uh, water. How are you not dead? How much how much damage do you take? All right, well now now that now she's dead. So, great. Ow. All right, last ditch effort. Can I use water to finish the finish the fight? There we go. Nope. Ah, uh, how much HP do you have? Jeez. Yeah, yeah, I know you win. Um, can I take anyone? Can Luca get another spell or not really? I mean, none of us are at level 30, but let me, let me just make sure. I don't want practice, no. All right. So yeah, let's heal. And honestly, I know we're about 20 minutes short, but honestly, this is a really good place to end off the stream. We did a lot today. We beat Magus. We beat those dragon guys. I forget their names already. 
we got our butts handed to us by a golem. Thankfully, we were actually, I guess we were kind of meant to lose that fight. But yeah, I'm really happy with the progress we made today. I'm going to save. And we are going to, uh, what is it called? What's our thing called now? To break the seal. All right. And we're going to quit. So, uh, yeah, bookmark. Cool. All right. Uh, let's see if anyone else is streaming right now. And if they are, I will uh, raid them. See who's raiding. Anyone else? Hold on. I'm just checking a couple of, uh, a couple of likely people who might be streaming now. One second. Um, all right. Let's see, let's see, let's see what else is going on on Twitch. Hold on. The whole Zeal Kingdom was very odd. You're absolutely right about that. Oh, no, but I don't want that. Hold on. Oh, hey, it's the Kingdom of Zeal. Um, all right. All right, uh, like, actually, you know what? Yeah, let's, let's actually raid Matt Big Fat, who was here earlier. Uh, can I quit out of this? Yes, I can. All right, so let me, uh, go back to the face cam, and we are going to raid Matt Big Fat. We made a lot of progress, though, today. I'm really happy about that. Uh, join us next time on Chrono Trigger, when we will make even more progress. Uh, I guess now we have to deal with La Lavos uh, and his pendant and whatnot. So let's see what we can do. Thank you very much, Jimmy. I really appreciate it. And yeah, we're going to raid. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'm 112 signing out for now. See you all later. Have a good night, everyone. Oh, oh one second. Hold on. I got to set this up. <laughs> Sorry about that. I guess... Fa False alarm for like five seconds. Uh... Oh, I did not. Uh, nope. Oh, sorry about that. I don't. I don't know what that was. But uh, I'm just trying to. All right, hang on a second. Not ready to raid yet, but uh, I will in a second. Come on, stupid ad. All right, now we'll raid. Th All right, now I'm really signing out for now. See you guys later.